Hello, my brothers and sisters, and welcome back to another Wrexham Packed episode. Chris the Butcher, friends. Now, what I've got down here, and you already know what it is by the thumbnail of the, the uh, thumb title, it's a Frey Bentos pie. Now, if you know if you know me and you've been around this channel for, a, for quite a while, you'll know there's probably not a Frey Bentos pie. I have not slid down my gizzard. Because I love Frey Bentos pies. You know I mean? well, it's another one of them things that you either love them or you hate them. I love the crispy, flaky pastry. And I love the soggy shit bottom it has with it as well. You know what I mean? And the filling's tasty. But this caught my eye when I was walking down the shops. And I mean, it jumped off the shelf and smacked me. King gob. So uh, let's give it one of these. Ladies and gentlemen, I give to you Chris the Butcher's Super Cool Review. Now, you all know I've done the Frey Bentos steak and gravy pie before, but look what he says on it. Better meat, more of it. That's what went shelf went ding. I'm like, oh, bloody hell, oh, I have to get that two quid. Two. As I was saying, two quid from uh, it was from the religion. Oh, it's, it's, it's literally two minutes down the road from me, the religion. Oh, it says back to our classic recipe. What was it before? It was all right before. Uh, it oven cooks in 30 minutes, which I've got the oven pre. I'm going to cut this actually in the oven. I want to do it justice. I was toying with putting the fill fryer or the cassori, but sod it, it's going in the oven. Uh, beef and gravy topped with puff pastry. And it's got, wait, 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 barley in it. Uh, beef, 25%. Now, I'm not 100% sure what the percentage of beef was in it last time. Uh, I suppose, uh, shall I Google it? Oh, dear, fact, tell me in comments, I can't be bothered. Googling it. I'll just end up on some random shit. I don't know how the fuck I got there. You know what I mean? Fucking cats falling over and I, I like watching videos of fit people falling on their ass. Fail army and stuff like that. I just love people falling over. It just makes me chuckle. You know what I mean? Right, humble pie for us, we put our hands up. Our recipe has not been up to scratch lately. So we brought back our classic steak and gravy recipe and are, are ready to reclaim our title as Dinner of Champions. That is a bold statement, Frey Bensos, isn't it? That is a bold statement. Right, anyway, let's get down here and flip this lid off. Magic. <laughs> no, it's not. I just opened it off camera because I know they could be a bastard to open. I don't know what we're expecting to look at. I've said this every time with a, with a Frey Bentos pie. That is what you get. Don't matter what flavour it is, what meat it is, that is is basically what you get so uh yeah there's not much look at i've got my oven preheated which it is now i'm going to stick it on a trusty that, that's the world's most dangerous frisbee right now but like that uh, chinese guy in, uh, uh, what's it called in james bond what was he called he had that hat and he used to sling his hat and chop the head off a statue oh tell me in comments because it's going to do my head in Right, anyway, uh, we'll see you guys in 30 minutes. Do you know what, brothers and sisters? That's been in 25 minutes. I know it said 30, but if I take that any longer now, it's just, I think it's just going to burn. Get off. Get off. There you are. Did that with only slightly burning myself. Uh, let's get in. Oh, it's hotter than the sun, that. I'll tell you now. Hotter than the sun. I ain't got a fork. Well, yeah, I've got a fork here. Let's give it a quick dry. Not draining, but what? So, as I did Google the meat content in the last one, and you'd have seen it on the screen. The, the old one was fifteen percent meat content. This is twenty-five. Now, is that going to improve the taste, or is it just about in generality? Is it just two or three pieces of steak more? I don't know, but. Like I said, like, whoa, look at that, Mount Vesuvius. Like I've said before, they, I love these pies. Oh. You see that, I did a piece of steak that I tried to pick up with, an, with a fork, 
I stuck my thing, my fork in it, and it, it, it obliterated. So the steak looks soft. It's going to be as good as a, a normal fray bentos pie to me, I think. But it was that. The better meat, more of it. And I'm like, you know what? I love a fray bentos pie. So it'd been rude not to. So I'm going to give that probably about five minutes to uh, for the molten lava to disappear. And then uh, we're going to get it down my gizzard. Do you know what? Change your mind. I'm just going to get into it because I'm starving. Alright. What I'm planning on doing is taking that right off. I can always add it. We all know what that pastry tastes like, don't we? I love that bit, me though. I do love that soft, soggy pastry. Oh, yeah. Especially when it's red hot and you get it in your gob and it sticks to every or every part of the inside of your gob like, like heat. <laughs> Let's get a bit of that grit. That steak. Apparently it's where 10% more than the usual. Come on, focus, you piece of steak bastard. Uh, that's about the best we're going to get it. And uh, get Demi Gizzard. Apart from being red hot, that just melted in my mouth. Absolutely no chewing whatsoever. Because some of these pies and stuff and tin and stuff... When you get, especially get the beef and the steak stuff, it can be a bit chewy. And I mean, I mean very chewy. And you can get a lot, of, a lot of undesirables in it. But that, that steak then, is absolute. Look, just fell off my fork and fell apart. Oh, that is. What can I say? You know what? I love a good Fray Bentos pie. If you don't like them, you don't like them. But if you love them, you love them. Just like me. Some of that hot, gooey mess I went on about. And I'm on about the, that and the Frey Bentos pie. Nothing else. Dirty minded bastards. Mm. Absolutely wonderful. Oh, yeah. Mm. Even that is orgasmic. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. Can I say, brothers and sisters? Oh! <laughs> Should that be the thumbnail? A big five bentos tin in front of me head, like that. Hello! <laughs> if you like Frey Bentos pies and you see that, get it. It's a two quid. You know what I mean? That's about standard for Frey Bentos pies. You do see them every now and then and offer it like a quid. That to me doesn't taste any different to the last steak and gravy one I had. Probably a bit of a sales ploy, you know, to get people, ooh, like myself, there, didn't I? I fell for it, I went in, boom, got it, better meat, more of it, and it's, it is more of it, don't say it's better, don't, you know, don't know if it's better, there's definitely more of it, there's 10% more of it than the other one, but, saying that, I just love a Fred Bentos pie, if you like this, press like, comment, Share it on your social media and subscribe. Blah. And become a family member of that tube CTB. Where I fucking love you.